आहोम बासिलाई मोर नमस्कार गवर्नर श्रीमान पद्मनाभ जी मुख्यमंत्री श्रीमान तरुण जी गवर्नर श्रीमान वी षणमुगनाथन मुख्यमंत्री श्रीमान डॉक्टर मुकुल सांगमा मंत्रिपरिषद के मेरे साथी सर्वानंद जी सोनवाल धर्मेंद्र प्रधान जी राज्य के मंत्री श्रीमान अजीत सिंह डेलीगेशन फ्रॉम सार्क कंट्रीज डिस्टिंग विद गेस्ट लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन आई फील प्रिविलेज एंड ऑनर्ड टू बी अमॉन्ग स्पोर्ट्स पर्सन फ्रॉम आवर नेबरहुड एंड ब्रदर्स एंड सिस्टर फ्रॉम सार कंट्रीज I welcome all all of you to India a country known for its culture of atithi devo bhava and to this beautiful city of guwahati known for its hospitality and love for sports what moves me today is your electrifying presence full of excitement and enthusiasm for this important international sports event on the banks of the mighty brahmaputra guwahati has come a long way since the days of prayag jyotishpura in ancient india it is now a modern and vibrant city and a hub of all economic activities in the north eastern region of india young people in northeast and especially especially here in assam do not miss any opportunity to witness a good football match this fame has spread also far and wide that fifa world cup under 17 which will be hosted first time in india in 2017 has chosen guwahati as a prime venue for the event this sports meet for me signifies a perfect blend of three t's team work and togetherness and talent among us <coughs> is the best and most youthful talent from across south asia you are proud member of your team it can be your team of the sport you play and a larger team of the nation you are representing and at the same time this meet also celebrates togetherness of all south asian nations afghanistan bangladesh bhutan india maldives nepal pakistan and sri lanka no matter which country we are from we all call south asia 
our home. Sport has to be an essential part of an individual's life. A good game is both healthy and refreshing. All around development of the personality is incomplete without sports. Most importantly, sports bring with it the most vital sportsman spirit. Without sports, there cannot be any sportsman spirit. This sportsman spirit will not only help you on the field, but also in other aspects of your life. You will cherish whatever you learn on the sports field for your entire life. I always say, jo khele, wo khile. The person who plays shines. The mascot of this game's Tikhor represents a baby rhino who is sharp and intelligent. It captures the spirit of sports persons and young sports lovers. The theme song of this game is E Prutvi E Kirangan Kira Hol Shantir Pongan sung by legendary late Dr. Bhupen Hajarika, a singer whose captivating voice left people spellbound. His song beautifully captures the spirit of South Asian games, the spirit of peace, friendship, and prosperity. I have been today, I have been told by Sri Sarbanandji Sonwalji that the organizing committee for the games has brought waters from the each of the eight shark countries. And this water will be much to signify shared aspirations and cooperative spirit among the South nations. Dr. Bhupen Hajarika's song, We Are in the Same Boat, Brother, which you hear, are going to hear soon, is all about shark nations. We should join hands together as a family. Let us kindle the spirit of friendship to sport in South Asian games. My vision for South Asia is the same as my vision for India. Sabka saath, sabka vikas. All South Asian countries are partners in our journey towards development. We, the people living in SAR countries, comprise 21% of the world's population and contribute 9% to its economy. As we gather today to commerce the 12th South Asian Games, for 23rd sporting events covering both men and women, we bring sports person from all SAR countries to India, Northeast, and to this great city and a spirit of friendship, trust, and understanding. I'm sure that as the games proceed, this feeling of friendship, trust and understanding will convert itself not only into sporting opportunities, but also into business and tourism opportunities as well. Let these games become a springboard for bringing peace and prosperity in the region through business, interaction, and sporting activities. Let this be an opportunity for Sark people 
to realize their potential. Sportsmanship is a philosophy of life, harmonizing in a balanced whole the qualities of endurance, will, and mind. The challenge for performance, the joy of efforts, the cheer of success, the spirit of friendship, and fair play in a sport arena speaks volumes about now how culture, education, ethics, dignity, and society get intervened with each other during such sports events. On the sport field, we can forget what separates us, and we can truly connect with each other in the spirit of sportsmanship and adventure. We can celebrate our diversity and at the same time be united under common rules for our sport and the shared values of honesty and fair play. Let us play for peace. Let us play for prosperity. Let us play with full vigor and enthusiasm so that we remember these games even after they are over. The friendships you made from over these 12 days and the memories you take back will last you a lifetime. I am confident that you will cherish these bonds and become ambassadors for peace and friendship between our nations. While people play for medals and provide tough competition to each other, I urge the sports persons and visitors here to take time from their budget schedules to visit the places of tourism attraction. And wonderful wildlife sanctuaries nearby. Once again, I welcome our friends from SAR countries. Let the spirit of Gurukul prevail for two weeks in Guwahati as sports persons share with each other their best and take back great feeling with warmth and remarkable experience. Let the competition be in true sportsman spirit. May the best win. And now I declare the 12th South Asian Games open. Thank you very much.